to another episode of Vet Talk. I'm Brother Vince. I'm a disabled veteran. And today I want to talk to you about the own word to opportunity benefits that's free for veterans. I want to talk to you about the own word to opportunity, better known as O2O, opportunity for free classes for veterans. But before we get into that, please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and you can find more content from Vet Talk on YouTube, Twitter, LinkedIn, Instagram, and Reddit for more content. And if you're a veteran and would love to share your story or resource for veterans, please feel free to contact me ASAP. Now that I got all the business aspect of Vet Talk out of the way, let's get into this topic. So I know the first question that you may be asking, Brother Vince, what is on to O? Well, O2O is an actual program that has been created to give veterans a free opportunity. Yes, I said it, free opportunity to gain their IT certifications and for business students. And I think this is a pretty cool program. And I think more veterans need to know about it so that they can enroll into this program. So what I'm going to do is, man, I'm going to go through it with you. I'm going to take you to this website, as you can see on the screen, and I'm going to read it for those who need me to read it for them. And for the others who don't want to um, listen to everything I have to say, I'm going to put the article down in the description so that you can go directly to it and you can read it for yourself. You can, you know, interpret it for yourself and you can just go through this thing for yourself. Now let's get into this. So what it says is on to, um, onward to opportunity O2O helps active duty selective reserve veterans and military spouses learn business technology and customer service skills to accomplish their personal and professional goals after military service. This program is, yes, free and combined industry validated courses, strong partnerships and comprehensive career coaching and employer relations services to match participate um participants with civilian job opportunity so the first question that they ask for people is why enroll into o2o well these are the bullet points that they have and it says in the first one free industry recognized certifications with exam fees and course included over 30 courses available in three um and demand career tracks, a comprehensive assessment tool to align training plans with skills, interests, and personal goals, in-person and vir in our virtual support from the Institute for Veterans and Military Families throughout your program journey, career path selections, interview on uh, preparation and employment service support, direct connection to over 400 military friendly employers open to national guard and reservists so that's why and then if you want to know what eligibilities you need to have um as far as um what they're requiring for you to um be eligible then it says that on to uh, um onward to opportunity o2o formerly known as the veteran transition program vc t p is a free program offering industry-specific training, credentials, and job placement services. O2O partners with private sectors companies to um, committed to training and hiring military talent and their spouses early in the transition process. If you are not located near one of our on-base insta uh, installations, we offer distant learning opportunities through the online the online only portion of the program. We will work with you to determine which program best fits your needs. Please check out eligibility requirements below. So these are the el eligibility requirements right here too. You have to be active duty armed US military. Any active duty service member who's transitioning from military service to civilian workforce in the next six months with an honorable discharge. So you must have an honorable discharge as far as active duty military, U.S. veteran, any veteran separated or retired from the military with an honorable discharge status. Again, you have to have an honorable discharge status. Then they have U.S. National Guard and Reservists. Any active member of the National Guard Reserve that is currently in a part-time status 
If this service member is on active duty status in the National Guard or Reserve, they are subject to active duty eligibilities. So if you're in the National Guard or Reserves and you're um, full-time, as they're saying in this description, then your eligibility requirements will be the same as somebody who's on active duty. And for spouses of an active duty U.S. military service member and U.S. veteran, an active member of the U.S. National Guard or Reserves. So they offer this program to spouses also. And I know most of you like, okay, well, I want to see what programs they're offering. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you and I'm going to show you the actual programs that they're offering so that you can see the um, list of the different you know, um, fields that they have on here. And I think that it's pretty cool um, to see the courses that they're offering. So from here, I can see information technology um, courses um, far as in cloud service, integration, cloud service with information security, cybersecurity, cybersecurity, integration, entry-level IT technician, um, they also, from what I can see, they also show you the um, the pathway, the certifications, and the um, certification prerequisites, course content providers, recommended um, career level. So they break this thing down to man where they are showing you everything up front so that you know what you're getting into um, firsthand, man. And I think that's pretty cool to see all these different courses that they're offering. And I wish I knew about some of this stuff back when I was seeking out um, a certification and becoming a, uh, at the time I was trying to get into, oh Lord, I'm having a brain freeze. I was trying to get into cybersecurity at the time and I became kind of discouraged with that path um, because it was just so much information at the time. I wasn't prepared or ready for it, but I wish I knew that before spending money trying to achieve a certification in that field and I end up not you know completing that course but here it is I found out that they offer this stuff for free and these are all the courses that they offer for free and I think it's pretty cool man I think it's pretty cool I think it's pretty cool that um they're willing to help us out as veterans and um military personnel too I think that's pretty cool let me see um what happens when you go to apply. So when you go to apply, um this is how it looks. This is what they want you to do. They want you to put your name in, they want you to put your email address, your birth date. They just want to really confirm um the information. Um and then I also see that um right here they have um do you currently live at within 50 miles of a reasonable commuting distance of any of the fallen military installations. So here it is. These are the specific military installations that they are seeking to find out if you're close to them. And if you're not close to them, again, as they said, um, you can take a lot of these courses online because they do have an online portion of um, online portion for their learning. And they do have like a um, Q&A section that I saw earlier where you can, you know, ask certain questions that you may have, because I know there are a lot of veterans um, and military personnel that may have a bunch of different questions about the program. And here is the, you know, the FAQ, you know, the, the question section. And, you know, they have a lot of... um different questions that you may have they they have answers for those and what i'm gonna do is because i don't want to go through all of them because there are so many questions that you may have i'm going to put the q and a section or the faq section in the description so that you can click on it and you know this information that's available for you to find out you can find out that information but um, basically, I just wanted to show you this opportunity because I think it's a great opportunity. I recently had a brother um, that I found out that was trying to get into the IT field and, you know, waiting for some things to happen. And this is a opportunity for him to do that for free. And I just wanted to offer it 
or not offer it, but, you know, just give the information to you veterans because I was giving this information and I just wanted to pass it along because one thing I learned as um, being a part of the veteran community, a lot of things we don't know if we don't talk, if we don't, you know, say things to each other or, we, you know, we don't kind of like, you know, put the information out there. It, then there's a lot of information, a lot of things that are hidden that, you know, most veterans don't know nothing about. And that's why v Vet Talk was created, because um, I was just like many veterans. Um, it was a lot of things that I didn't know about the VA. There were a lot of things that I didn't know about um, certain benefits and entitlements that we we have out here. And because of somebody telling me, I was able to find out. And for free, I just wanted to pass on something that was given to me for free to the next person. You know, they call it each one, teach one. So this is really what Vet Talk is all about. It's just about me as a veteran sharing information, resources, and my story. But also I want to share your information, your story, and resources for other veterans. And even if you're a non-veteran, I'm not saying that only veterans have information and resource for veterans, but I wanted to start and lay the foundation for veterans to do so. But if there are non-veterans that have information and resources and things for veterans, then I would like to share that too, because any little bit can help someone else, just as it has helped me throughout my time. So as always, you know, this has been another episode with your boy, Brother Vince from Vet Talk. As always, my great people out there, Vet Talk out.